Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to local music and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're once again back for another songwriter showcase at 18 Bin in Las Vegas' downtown arts district. Hosted by the human jukebox himself, Hal Savar, these showcases are quickly becoming a breeding ground for local songwriting talent, and every event is basically a Room 6 alumni reunion. With another vintage bike night also happening at the front of the place, this one promised to be fun. You know what time it is. To the Room 6 Mobile! This video is brought to you by Canva. We'll hear more about them later. But for now, let's get on to today's video. Like most of Hal's songwriter showcases, this one was also live streamed by yours truly. If you'd like to check out the live stream from this event, there's a link down below for uh, that as well. Additionally, if you'd like to be featured on Room 6, whether reviewed, interviewed, or both, hit me up using my email address down in the description, or click the Room 6 social media link for ways to contact me, where else I'm online, and ways to support the channel. Thanks! Kicking things off this time was Kazmus, ready to rock everyone's socks off. With a fiery passion infused in his music, Kazmus and his band have no trouble grabbing a crowd's attention and rocking the joint. His songs are catchy and powerful with emotive lyrics, and the band was tight and obviously having a good time on stage. Cranking up the unusual meter on the night, Masters of Resonance attack the stage next. Quickly becoming showcase favorites with their unique blend of a kick drum playing keyboardist, a flute playing trombonist, a face painted screamo singer, and a bassist dressed like a Russian gym coach from the 80s, there's no doubt when they hit the stage. You owe it to yourself to catch their one of a kind sound live if you get the chance. Finally hitting the stage at the show he was hosting, Hal Savar and his band were next. Hal's been putting out new music a lot lately, and I've been fortunate to review some of it on the channel. You can find them on the channel by searching for his name. As for the showcase, he and his band put on another solid showing of well-written music performed by talented musicians. I'm so glad to call him a friend and a friend of the channel. And now, a word from our sponsors. Thanks, Josh, from the past. You know, people often underestimate the power of a well-designed graphic or a cohesive image for your entire project. That goes for YouTubers and for musicians. By now, you've probably heard of Canva, but have you heard of Canva Pro? Canva Pro is the design software that makes design simple, convenient, and reliable. Create what you need in no time. Jam-packed with time-saving tools that make anyone look like a professional designer. Just for watching this video and for being part of Room 6 and for a limited time only, you can use my affiliate link down in the description to get a 30-day free trial. Plus, you'll be helping out the channel. Thanks to Canva for being a sponsor, and let's get back to the show. Fresh off of hosting his own songwriter showcase at Slice 19, which I've reviewed in another video, Joe the Associate was next. Joe and his band specialize in classic rock sounding originals with some quirky themes and lyrics. Whether singing crowd favorites like The Human Zoo or Sharks, Joe and the gang do a great job evoking feelings of nostalgia and humor at the same time. It's always fun to watch them perform, and this time was no exception. Finishing off the night and making their showcase debut, So Not So hit the stage. This three-piece band came out guns blazing with straight-ahead rock tinged with a little bit of grunge and a little bit of alternative. With all three members on vocals at some point, there were plenty of opportunities for layered instrumentation and pivotal musical moments. They're definitely worth checking out, and they were a great way to close out the night. Overall, the second installment of the Songwriter Showcases at 18 Bin in the Arts District was a hoot, and I'm so glad I got to check it out. I hope we'll see you at the next one, or at least on the live stream. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that you will swing by 18 Bin if you're in the Arts District and have a few moments. And I hope that you will check out the social media handles down in the description for every act featured in this video. Other than that, if you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. If you'd like to subscribe, click over there, ring the bell, you know the drill. And if you want to hear my own music, please click over there. Remember to be amazing. We'll see you next time on Room 6.